What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. Um, um today we're not having any news but today we're talking we're just making a discussion video about the Crash Bandicoot 5 which is the cancelled game. So in the previous video I talked about it and about that the game um, was a crossover and we wished that this game was uh, was over there, believe me. Um, but I'm gonna say my thoughts on those moves. Um, if we let's just discuss a little bit. If we return back to um, February 2024, when we got that Toys for Bob has gone indie and that they're working on, and that they're so thrilled. To work on new games this made me so thrilled um, this is something so like this this means so much to the to Crash Bandicoot and Spyro um, but also um, um, there were just bad news so anything can get cancelled easily so um, like the Spyro 4 now in development Crash Bandicoot 5 was even in development since um, summer 2020 and it stopped in November 2020 as um, the development of this game um, was all about a Crash and Spyro crossover game, um, Crash riding on Spyro and it was something really great to see. We even took a look at some um, some photos or some arts about the game we can see Uka Uka and some other masks I don't know what are those masks um, I, maybe yeah, I didn't see them actually but I don't know who are they but um, we're having Uka Uka and of course we're having Aku Aku in the game and of course we got um, I I told you the story in the previous video, so check it out. I just want to talk about it. Um, if this game just launched, it will be. It means. It means something. I mean. This means. Too much to us, believe me. Like, uh, this means a lot to us. As we are Crash and Spyro fans, so. The people who are asking for a Spyro game, this is not a Spyro game, this is a Crash game, but um, they wanted to see Spyro again. So the last thing we saw about Spyro was that Spyro 4 is in development and we also saw that um, Spyro was in Crash Team Rumble as a character in the game, which really made a lot of Spyro fans really buy this game. Um, who are only Spyro fans, not Crash, not Crash fans. The people who like Spyro only, maybe they just bought the game for Spyro. This is actually better. Maybe this made the game just blow up. Um, the, which is Crash Team Mumble because a lot of people, like more people, wanted to buy it. Um, I know. The number of people who bought this game or the number of players are too low compared to um, the other compared to like Crash Bandicoot and Team Prodigy or Crash Team Racing or Crash 4 or even Crash on the Run. It's um, low compared to them, but I still love this game. But if Crash Bandicoot 5 launched, it will blow up the world. Believe me. Um, we want this game. We want a Crash and Spyro crossover. We've been talking about this for a long time and speculating about it. Um, we have the um, Crash Orange Ripto's concept. Uh, sorry, um, like the, uh, the Crash Bandicoot Orange Ripto's concept or whatever it's called. Um, this game. Uh, 
the really great thing about it is that it's a crossover. They're adding spiral characters to the game. So um, the game was supposed to have or was supposed to feature even more characters such as Lena Cortex and characters like that if they just want will be something great. I would really appreciate it. I really wanted it but this is all I can say. We're waiting for Spiral 4 right now. Or maybe they're working on another project or another game so maybe like the Crash Bash remake. This is one of the things I want. Crash Bash was a really fun game. And even in 2003 we had Crash Metal Card. So 2000 so um, right now currently I think Crash Man 2000 Spiral. Um, maybe they're dead right now. I'm just done. But as you all can say, thanks for watching and goodbye. That's all I can say. Um, maybe we're having other games. I love Crash Bash. It's one of my favorite Crash games. And about Spyro, um, I really want Spyro 4. And I want to see. I just want to know what is the future of Crash and Spyro. Um, um, we used to get like. Every year we used to get like um, a Crash Bandicoot game. Um, if you take a look at the beginning of Crash Bandicoot from 1996 to till 2010, you can see every year they added a game like Crash Bandicoot 1, then Crash 2, Crash 3, Crash Bash. <coughs> oh, sorry, Crash the Amazing, then Crash Bash. We had Crash the Wrath of Cortex, Crash Bandicoot the Huge Adventure. We had even um, more games. Such as the, two, the 2003 game um, Crash Bandicoot Enhanced, and 2004 we had um, this, which is um, Crash Bandicoot um, Riptos Conspiracy, whatever it's called. Um, we have um, 2005 Crash Tag Team Racing, and I think also in 2000, 2004 we also had um, Crash to Insanity. So two games in this year, which is so great 2006 uh, crash boom bang which is the worst crash game um so this year was a failure to crash man could believe me um 2007 we had um crash of the titans 2008 crash mind of the mutant and we got two um two failed games in 2009 i think it was Oh yeah, Crash Bandicoot Mutant Island and 2010 we have Crash Nitro Kart um, 2 I 